Uh, Congressman Tom Marino was um, on the committee today, uh, the House Judiciary Committee that handled the questioning of the Google uh, CEO and joins us now from Capitol Hill. Uh, Congressman, thanks for coming. I was watching your questioning You're and welcome. the follow-up on Edwards' reporting there. You really raised the China issue with the Google CEO. And then to his point in the afternoon, he was asked about a prototype. As he, he told you earlier in the, in the hearing that, you know, we have no plans to get into China. Is the answer good enough for you today? No, it wasn't good enough for me. And I, I knew uh, about the prototype. I ran out of time because that's the next area I was going to get into. But it's, it's uh, ironic that he said that uh, no one person would have the ability to uh, manipulate the, the uh, logarithms that they have that uh, sends out information. But look at it from this perspective. Maybe not any one person, but don't forget, over 93% of the uh, people who work there uh, contributed to liberals. And so collectively, they certainly, uh, they certainly can and right. get the messages out that they want to do. Right. So you're, oh, and, you're talking now about, obviously, you're talking about the conservative bias, or the allegations of yes, conservative yes. bias. Now, you didn't uh, raise that. To, you didn't, a lot of your colleagues raised that, but I noticed you chose, yeah. to, you chose to use your five minutes as you said on on China. So you, exactly. So and, why, and that's why, why did you do that, by the way? Well, because China is a very big concern to me. As I said, uh, we know that uh, right now as we speak, uh, thousands, maybe hundreds of thousands of, of Chinese are sitting at computers uh, attempting to hack into the United States and anywhere they can, financial system, uh, defense system. And uh, Russia's doing the same thing, but not to the level that the Chinese can do it because of their population. And when I asked him, I said, uh, do you plan on, uh, I didn't say plan, what, what business do you, right. are you going to get into with China? Well, we don't plan on that. And that's why I quickly went to the next question. Is, well, when you do decide, or if you do decide, how much information are you going to give? And he said he'd come to back give? to you, right? He said he'd come back, which, I was, uh, yes. which is interesting. What's the responsibility of an American company, in this case, Google, when they're operating? A lot of American companies obviously do operate in China. Maybe it's a little different for a technology company. What's, what is his responsibility? Does he have one to actually come back to Congress and talk about what the operations would look like for a private He's, company going into China? He certainly does. He does have a responsibility. That's why I started out my uh, questioning with a statement to him that uh, uh, he has a, a responsibility, an enormous responsibility, obviously, to his company, but more so to the American people of being fair down the middle, not swaying. They, they, no other entity out there that deals with news, whether it's TV, radio, or print, has uh, the power uh, all at once to uh, be in contact with tens and hundreds of millions of people, and he knows that. They know that. And I'm just concerned that profit is going to take over here mm -hmm. at the risk of at the risk of China getting a lot of information about what Google is doing in the United States to serve their needs. What's yeah. to prevent them from saying, okay, we'll do business, but we're going to do business according to what uh, we want, and we want to know if someone even comes into our country from the United States, right. uh, we, we want to know what information well, they have. It's interesting, Congressman. I feel like you earlier today. I have a lot of other questions, but I'm, uh, I'm out of my time here as well. They're, they're giving me the buzzer. So thank you very much for coming on, uh, Congressman Marino. We'll talk about this more in the future. Thanks for coming on today.